Okay, first cut, super simple. You are going to love this. It is amazing. I couldn't be more excited. I'm opening up Silhouette Studio now. Page setup panel opened up. It is set to the Curio 2. As you can see, here is my design mat, and it has a representation of the Curio 2 behind that. For the tray, I have the electrostatic bed selected, protector sheet only for the cutting mat, media size letter. I'm just doing a simple circle on a piece of copy paper and we're going to see how this goes. Let's draw the circle out real quick. Nothing fancy. Head over to the sun panel. I have copy paper medium selected. It is showing up with a blade depth of two, force of 15, one pass, and a speed of 10. Let's go ahead and hit send. This screen now pops up. This is different for sure. It gives you step-by-step -step instructions. You're going to need to load your copy paper onto the electrostatic bed. Make sure your auto blade is loaded into the uh, carriage one. And then I left the automatic material thickness detection enabled. Let's send it through. I'm setting up the electrostatic base, making sure everything is smoothed out. Setting the paper down there, letting that charge build up a little bit. Here I had an air bubble and I needed to release that. Start smoothing it out again. Now you can see the blade manually finding the depth of the material, the thickness of the material. It's very cool to watch. The blade is going to adjust. Here goes the simple circle. Once the cut is finished, the electrostatic base turns itself off and releases the mat. You can see the paper comes off so easily, no curling, no tearing, it is wonderful. There is a mark on the mat that is going to happen. You just don't want it to cut all the way through. You want to make sure that your settings are correct and so you can do minimal damage to the mat. I love the added prompts from the software. That was fabulous. I hope that you are going to try this out soon and I will see you in the next video.